Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing Tamadachi Life, the fever dream that uh, frankly feels like a nightmare. I mean, it looks very cheery on the surface, but under the surface there is something very, very creepy. Anyway, let's get started. <laughs> Nothing like an impending sense of dread to get you started. <laughs> right, let's go visit the fountain for my daily teeth from all the villagers. Oh, look at them all lining up. God, they are a wacky bunch. I hope little Kev can even reach the top of the piggy bank. Poor little guy. All right, what do we have to do to unlock some of the other things? To open an islander wedding. Oh, <laughs> give an object to an islander that has leveled up. Surely I've done that by now. What is happening to Kevin? Someone confesses their love, unlocks this little island. I guess we banish them to the island if they do that. God, it's a lot about love on this little island. It's as if it's some kind of Love Island. <laughs> Welcome to Love Island and time to meet our first contestant. Call me Kevin is a professional gamer. Take a picture of Ami's room. Oh my god, that, that's easy. Oh my god, look how hench Grognak is compared to the villain RT. <laughs> look at them go, look at those squats. Right, let's check in on everyone before we get started making a new character. And we're in a bit of a bind here because we've got another series, uh, Metopia, which is using the characters from this series. So we really need to generate some more people here. Wait, what is this? Something opened. Wait, what What happened? All I did was feed Turk pizza and it opened on Love Island. Does Turk love pizza? <laughs> it's a photo studio. Oh my god, this is amazing. Take stylish photos of your islanders. Yes, let me in. Wedding too. I think we'll pick uh, a Turk and default. <laughs> default does not have strong feelings one way or the other. I'm just trying to make them a thing. I should really stop trying to make them a thing because it's not working. <laughs> oh, did not mean to add Jim. Uh, that's probably more realistic outcome, but still. <laughs> oh, now that is a nice picture. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. Why are they still blinking? Their eyes are closed. <laughs> oh, this will be a good one. Now you guys can edit in your own outcomes. There we go. Take that picture and tweet it at me. I'm sure you can put them in interesting situations. Honestly, I'm not sure you could put them in weirder situations than the game is letting me. Like, look at that. There we go. I think they're super villains in this picture. They look pissed. And here we go. Here's the album cover for Direland, the band of Dan the Villain and Little Kev. Little Kev does the rap. Rapping parrots. Please watch us and subscribe to Roblox. I think that's a better picture. A <laughs> school photo. God damn. Do not turn that frown upside down or it might fall off your face. Oh, that is lovely. Look at that. I love their expressions. They're like Jim and Turk with big smiles. Gorg is pissed. Default is neutral as always. And little Kev is there sad just thinking, why couldn't I be in the background up on the big step? <laughs> oh my God. I think I may have found a poster for the Kevin Cinematic Universe. Look at that for a picture picture. Good God, can you all stop blinking for just one second so I can get a picture of you all? No, <laughs> All right, that, your eyes are open, but you're still blinking. Okay, now all of your eyes are closed. Now you're not blinking, but you all look pissed off. All right, I'll just try and take a few and hopefully get one good one. Well, that was a great distraction. <laughs> Jesus, I got way too into that. All right, let's see what everyone wants. I have a feeling most of them just want food since I haven't fed them in a week. I'd like to eat something. Something sweet, huh? You looking for beans? Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. Ron leveled up because I fed him jelly. I guess he went jelly. Beans. Jelly beans. <laughs> and he just immediately levels up. Okay, I gave him a phrase. Beans. Beans. There you go. <laughs> God, you're so unlikable. <laughs> Oh, come on, Dan. <laughs> You're enough of a villain already. What do you need now? I'd like a new hat. You'd like a new hat. All right. You know what? That's reasonable. That's not a great hat you got on there. All right. I'll put that on the shopping list. Oh, Grognak just wants a phrase to say when they're worried. I hate Ron. That'll do. <laughs> That'll do perfectly. Their hatred of Ron almost leveled them up. I wonder who's more popular. <laughs> I wonder who's more popular, me or RT Game. I'm sorry to say, Grognak. But it's RT Game. Trust me, it hurts me too. Picasso's twerking, which means they want something. That's how I teach my characters and pets to do when they need something. That's how I know my dog is hungry. He just torques for me. I want some food with- You want food with eggs. Okay, so I've got child-sized hat and food with eggs on my shopping list. And Gorg just wants to sneeze. God, you're easy to please, aren't you? You're easy to please, so give me that sneeze. Come on, give me that sneeze. Give me the sneeze. This is so uncomfortable to look at. It's gone. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't even get a sneeze. I mean, given the times we're in, it's probably better off he didn't sneeze it right in my face. Oh, and what would Jim like? Oh, I scared the bejesus out of him. I'd like some new, new clothes. Okay. 
Okay. A child size hat, food with eggs, and new clothes for Jim. I think the only kids hat they have is this ice cream hat, which honestly just looks like poop. So I guess I'm buying that for RT. Oh, cowboy outfit. <laughs> I'm buying the cowboy outfit. I hope Jim likes assless chaps. Arabian prince outfit. Yes, <laughs> sure. Why not? And now just food with eggs. <laughs> Our shopping list is complete. What a weird list of items. Ah, oh, yes. Food with eggs. Children's hat. And assless chaps. Okay. <laughs> uh, I don't see anything with eggs. At least nothing that I think has eggs in it. Wait, white bread has egg in it, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's why it's white. Yeah, buy him some white bread. Oh, you're excited for your eggy bread, aren't you? Oh, wait, you want to play a game now? I thought you were starving. <laughs> they are indeed. I know my my creations well. They're my only friends. So it's hard not to know about them. Same personality. I don't know. You're both pretty unlikable. That is entirely possible. Why do they always have to ask me about my least favorite characters, all right? Just stick to the main cast and then I'll know. It's like doing a Harry Potter quiz and then asking me about one of the goblins that works at Gringotts. Like, nobody cares. The hell are you doing? Extreme yawning? What is this? Are you yodeling? <laughs> Here you go, Jim. I hope you like it. Oh, well, howdy. Oh, you don't like it? What the hell? It's because the uh, chaps aren't assless, isn't it? Great, Ron just came to visit and sneeze all over my room. He's a horrible person. Hey, RT, I got you some poop. <laughs> you want to try it on? <laughs> he likes it a little. <laughs> I'm going to say I... What do you think? I'm going to say I want to die when I'm angry. Yeah, let's keep it that way. That's fine. <laughs> Bit of a diva myself, so I get it. I want to die. Yeah, that's great, Turk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game is fantastic. It's finally time to add a new me. And we're going to be adding a classic. Something that's been requested basically since this series began. An older sim. A Jim Pickens' neighbor, Dennis. I think it would be fun to have someone in there that's kind of like his alter ego. No, we're adding Erp. <laughs> Erp John, who is from the start of my Sims series. He's been requested a lot. So let's try our best. The forearm god himself. God, he's looking like a Chad so far. <laughs> he's got that crimson chin. <laughs> I think the bags under the eyes suit him and he, he just kind of looks weary. Like he thought he got out of this cinematic universe, but then he gets pulled back in. Luckily, his forearms are naturally bigger <laughs> than, <laughs> than his upper arm for some reason. Unfortunately, he's not a very standout character. He's not that unique, is he? It's unusual for my characters to be so basic, you know, other than one deformity. They usually have many deformities. <laughs> oh my god, he looks so fecked. Lives at their own pace and never rushes into anything. Deep down, they may worry a lot. <laughs> you have reason to worry, Erp. Oh, little Kev, what's wrong with you? Do you need your cage cleaned? I'm after a plain looking hat. He's after a plain looking hat. I don't think I have anything for you, unfortunately. No, all of my hats are a bit odd. Well, Tell you what I do have. I have food for you. Fill up that hamster bowl with some jelly. Yeah, you like jelly, don't you? I haven't come to visit you in a week, but it doesn't matter because I brought jelly. We're going to give you a heavy metal song. Eternal darkness. Lucid dream wakes screaming. Lightning crashing <laughs> deafens me. Blazing fury awakes. Heart beating arise. Jesus Christ, this is something else. All right, here we go. Here's little Kev singing my rusty cage. Some heavy metal. This is a dream. The bars of my cage mock me. All the men in Adam are beating the fire in shit. Water, darkness, unending. Cage is dirty. He smells it. Killing me. And I wish it would. Maybe someone should reach out to little Kev. <laughs> That song was a bit dark. It was a bit too real. I'm after a plain looking hat. <laughs> after all that song, he's just like, can I have that plain hat now? And then he goes dancing around his cage. Okay, maybe he's fine. I'd like a new hat. Everyone just wants hats today. Okay, that's two hats on the list. Anyone else want hats? I'm going hat shopping and doing a bit of a hat run. I'm feeling thirsty. A lot of the islanders are thirsty for you, Default. You better watch out. <laughs> I know how indifferent you are on them. I found this. Wait, what did you find? Is that a DS? Hey, it has grown. 
It has Grognak written on the back. Uh, they do have Amnosia. Maybe they forgot where it was. I'm so relieved. I'm sure you are. Now you can play Tamadachi Life while I play Tamadachi Life with you in it. I assume there's more levels to this. There's probably someone else playing Tamadachi Life and I am a me. In fact, I am me. Okay, I just blew this case wide open. I can give them uh, an item that they can use? A cat voucher. <laughs> a dog voucher. What even does that mean? Let's just say one free dog on it? I think maracas would suit you well. Here's some maracas, Grognak. They suit your attire. <laughs> Oh, I, I guess that was the thing from earlier. Giving them a gift they can use. I see. I understand. I'm not in the habit of giving gifts. <laughs> I didn't understand it. Quirky questions will be held at the observatory. Oh, oh, this is great. Let's play quirky questions. Select a question, fill in the blank. Who'd prefer to have been born as... What? Who'd prefer to have been born as dead? <laughs> Ask. Me. <laughs> It's just said, it's just said, me in the background is so monotone. Who hates Cal Macabin? <laughs> also, Jim, okay. I mean, I guess we're kind of rivals. We're both trying to control the situation. Who has tried to kill an island? Me. Also, Jim. Okay. I think I'm targeting Jim with these questions. Thanks for playing. Well, that was just great. Oh, we got some breaking news. What's up? Tell me, Gorg. This bus stop. What? <laughs> the bus stop is running away, apparently. I don't blame inanimate objects trying to flee the island. All right, I need to go get hats. I need two hats. I can't even remember who <laughs> I need them for. I just realized one of them was little Kev, and he asked for a plain hat. I'm after a plain looking hat. And I bought a Chinese lion mask and a broccoli hat. And he wants to play a game. Okay, let's play before I give you the gift because I have a feeling it'll be putting you in a bad mood. Oh, this stupid game where I need to catch the item. Oh, you little bastard. You little bastard. Don't say oops. I knew you did that on purpose. Too bad. Oh, you feckin' idiot. I hate you. Drop it. Come on. Too bad. Oh my... <sighs> I hate myself. By which I mean him, not me. But like also kind of me. Here's your feckin' broccoli hat. Come on, put it on. How do you like that? <laughs> he somehow does like it for some reason. He actually loves it. Oh, look at this little picture. He's not even in frame. Oh, Jamantha's having a little dream, by which I mean uh, a terrifying nightmare, I assume. Let's go take a look. Ah, yes. Of course. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> it's a very common dream. It means you have a fear of hats, I believe. And then you somehow get it in real life as well. It's it's a common thing. Erp is out working his part-time job. God, he got a job fast. Where's he working? <laughs> Where are you? What is this? You're selling smelly socks? I'll take one, please. <laughs> Gamer boy socks. Oh, wait, no, this is selling stuff. Okay, I sold him my smelly sock. All right, so I've reached this point in my career, I see. Oh, Grog and I came sprinting in at the idea of getting a hat. All right, I got you this Chinese lion mask. It suits your attire, I think. It, it really matches your, your top. You like it? Oh, Grognak loves it. I'm starving. Oh, yeah, I forgot to feed you. Jesus, I kind of neglect some of them. I don't really even visit them. <laughs> I was like, I think I'm kind of done, but no, no, I'm not. Yeah. He's giving me a reward for just feeding him. It's like, maybe this will convince him to come back. Okay, I think everyone's tended to today. You know what that means? It's time for a thong. <laughs> They're like, please, just, just feed us and leave us alone. Stop forcing us to sing these songs. All right, make a group. Default and Turk. What is the group's name? Turk's making the band. He's like, we should just make it like yeah, like a future couple or something like that. That would be so funny. Like like as a joke. That would be, that'd be really funny. Unless... God, nope opera really have their <laughs> new style don't they turk is still sticking with the classic look but they've gone vastly different directions they'll probably break up and do a solo career or something all right your breakout single is going to be called couple goals and you each write your own parts all right here is future couple singing their hit new single couple goals <laughs> Wow, that is fantastic. I love the little and <laughs> disagree. It's a bit of a slurp there. You can really hear the saliva, and so you can tell it's a good microphone. 
And I guess we'll end the episode to Mikasa just looking out in the ocean, wondering why they're not as loved as some of the other characters. Even when I added Mikasa, a lot of the subreddit, uh, r slash call me Kevin, just uh, weren't feeling it. They wanted Earp instead, and uh, this is what you've done. Your actions have consequences. Well, on that very happy note, I guess we're gonna end the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I always love playing Tamadachi Life, and it's good to have Earp on the island now. <laughs> I just love this game so much. It's so funny to me. But I hope you enjoyed. I appreciate you watching, as always. If you want to see more of me, I post every day, and I stream over on Twitch as well. The link to that is in the description. But uh, other than that, I'll just thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.